Everyone's here, General. There it is. Pretty impressive, huh? Its real name is Fort Independence, but the Minutemen always just called it the castle. Now you can see why I wanted to take it back. Maybe. Those walls could definitely use some work. I'll admit, it's seen better days. But the Minutemen have never been afraid of hard work. Our primary objective is to clear the courtyard. That's where we should see the most opposition. The wall on this side is the most exposed, but if we circle around south, we could also reach the main gate. What are we waiting for? Let's just get in there and shoot those lobsters. No. If we split up, we can flank them from both sides. It'll be like shooting fish in a barrel. Why not let them come to us? We set up a firing line on this side and you can draw them out. Well, General, what do you think? Set up a firing line and I'll draw them out. Sounds good. We'll hold back and wait for them to come to us. Just don't get yourself trapped in there. All right, people. You heard the general. Let's move out. Try not to draw their attention until we're in position.
been a long time since the Minutemen lost this place. The years have never been so Found them and they do not Alright. No point in leaving that for the scavengers. What was that?
this was all mine. like they've been nested. We have to take out these eggs. They'll be back before we know. Looks like the hold up inside of the wall. The walls are probably full of them. Sure looks that way. Here's our decision. Hold here in the courtyard and take care of any eggs you find. The general will hold through the wall. Yes, sir. Let's do this, General. Hmm, walking into a confined space overrun by monarchs. What did you get me into? What the hell was that? Ooh, come on. You need to carry something before you cripple yourself. Hey. What can I do? Probably have something you can use.
Doesn't look like junk to me. Let's focus on getting the radio fixed for right now. All right, good work people, but we aren't done yet. The general and I are gonna have a look at the radio to see what shape it's in. The rest of you, clear out any remaining Meyer Lurks or eggs you find. Let's go see if there's anything left of the old transmitter. Once I power this up, we'll be ready to broadcast. Hell yeah. Well, I guess it could be worse. See what you can do with it. I'm gonna go see what else is left around this old place. Once I power this up, over there we'll be ready power. to broadcast. We could broadcast to the whole Commonwealth. Once I power this up, we'll be ready to broadcast. Once I power this up, we'll be ready to broadcast. Once I power this up, We'll be ready to broadcast. Once I power this up, we'll be ready to broadcast. One day, we'll put this back together. Better than ever.
nobody's going to believe that we actually killed that thing. Wow, we really did it. I've been watching the men and men fall to pieces for so long, I just... This is really something. Now we've got to pay off on what we've started. Bring the whole Commonwealth together and make it last this time. So, you know, back to business. But with Radio Freedom up and running, we can broadcast alerts to you anywhere, anytime. I'll let you know if I hear of any settlements that need our help. In the meantime, make sure to offer help to anyone that needs it. That can only help our cause. Once I power this up, we'll be ready to broadcast. Once I power this up, we'll be ready to broadcast. So... I want to trade a few things. We've got to get the transmitter powered back up before I can get back to broadcasting. Once I power this up, we'll be ready to broadcast. What was that? Just let me know. Hey, Piper. You know, the Institute has a lot of enemies. The Minutemen tangled with them once. The Railroad still does. I've even got some notes on these new guys. The Brotherhood of Steel. You said something about the, the Railroad. Supposedly they help runaway synths escape the Institute, but they're secretive. Ultra paranoid. The only thing I have is a rumor. A, a code phrase. Follow the Freedom Trail. That Brotherhood airship is hard to miss. Yeah, the Brotherhood of Steel doesn't do subtle. From what I've heard, they take whatever they want. Especially if it's high tech. They just might have the muscle to give the Institute a run for their money, but they're... Let's just say they have their own agenda. Tell me about the Minutemen. You know that group you rescued and conquered? As far as I know, they're the last Minutemen left in the Commonwealth. 
They used to be a volunteer army dedicated to protecting friends, family, and neighbors. Sounds soft, but they were a real thing at one point. We should get going. All right. Hey. Shoot. You know, I still really appreciate the fact that you're not an idiot. Uh, thanks? I guess? No, I, I didn't mean like... I could just use some help. This isn't the sort of thing I'd normally bother anyone else with, but you just seem really good with people, and I've got this issue with my sister, Nat, becoming me. Becoming you? What do you mean? I'm just terrified she's going to start taking up like her big sis. I mean, think about the life we lead. No offense intended, Blue, but personal safety doesn't exactly seem like either of our strong suits. I can't have her ending up like her big sister. Dodging bullets and running from all the people she pisses off. It's part of the reason I'm on the road so much. Part of the reason I'm here with you. I keep thinking, maybe if I make myself scarce, if I'm not around her enough, she'll cool off. She'll just go back to being sweet, innocent Nat. Paper girl, an all-around upstanding citizen. What do I do, Blue? You just love her. Family's precious. The last thing you want to do is drive them away, because you might lose them forever. You're right. I can't risk that. Thanks, Blue. Who'd expect wandering off with a stranger to turn out this well? They really don't make them like you anymore. You're a hell of a friend, you know that? Just friends, huh? But a friend for life. Or at least as long as you don't start annoying me. But hey, thanks again for listening. It's a real weight off my chest to be able to talk it out with someone. So, you wanna hit the road? Heads up. Point the way. Piper. Hey, here. Something to keep you sharp. Always worked for me. Are things all right between us? Not a lot of complaints at the moment. And you can ask around. That is a rare occurrence. Your thoughts? Have any more questions about the Institute's enemies, Blue? We should get going. All right. Right behind you. If you wanted to make me a second printing press while you're at it. Now everyone in the Commonwealth will know, the Minutemen are back.
Seems to be in working order. Seems to be in working order. Howdy, General. Radio Freedom. Nothing to report at the moment. Stay tuned for updates.
Well, you're still alive. That either means you haven't gone after those super mutants yet, or... Huh. Good news. I knew you would help us. Those super mutants won't be bothering you again. I guess you are the right person for the job, huh? Thanks, friend. By the way, we've decided to support the Minutemen. We've got to help each other if we want things to get better. I just want to trade a few things. Sure thing. Good to meet ya. We need more water. Even another water pump would help. I'd like to trade some items. Sure. Let's I trade some things. I how much you did for us. Okay. Mm, fresh tar berries. Let's see now.
Andy are